Hi everyone, I'm Tyler, and in this video I want to quickly show you how to use SketchUp to build different greenhouse designs. This is going to help you visualize your system better, plan, and get an idea for how you might want to lay out your own greenhouse. SketchUp is great because it's a free software and almost anyone can use it. It also gives us exact measurement, which is really important when we're planning. My coworker Jason has been making a lot of components for SketchUp, and what this is going to allow us to do is simply import these components and then we can copy and paste them into place. And we can place them paste them within our structure. We won't have to draw anything. And this is going to speed up our process and really allow us to visualize our system. If you use the link below this video and submit us your email, you'll have access to all these components and you can download them and share them. So here we go. I've downloaded the SketchUp bundle and SketchUp is already open on my computer. I've already imported the 20 foot by 36 foot greenhouse into SketchUp. I'll be outfitting this entire greenhouse with Zipcro towers. Now as a grower, you can build an entire greenhouse using Zipcro Towers, or you can choose to incorporate them with other growing techniques. When we use Zipcro Towers in a greenhouse, we like to put them into racks. This is one of the components that Jason has built for us. So I'm going to import one of these racks. A rack consists of 25 towers, five rows of five towers, and has a footprint of five feet by 10 feet. Within the rows, the towers are 18 inches apart, and there are 22 inches between each row. This allows growers to easily move between rows and monitor their crops. Now, you can tighten up the spacing between your towers and the rows, depending on how bushy your crops are, but 18 inches is a good middle ground. So I'm going to place this rack into the greenhouse. The nice thing about SketchUp is you can precisely snap your components to the layout. Now I can select this component, hit copy and paste, and I'll repeat this process. Here we have three racks for a total of 75 towers. I can select all three racks and copy and paste them onto the other side of the greenhouse. Now the entire greenhouse is built out using 150 zip grow towers. Our SketchUp bundle includes other components such as sumps, irrigation, and workbenches. When building your greenhouse, it's important to think of all of these components. The cool thing about SketchUp is that it's an open source software. As users expand with building their greenhouses, they'll develop more components just like Jason has, and these components can be shared with everyone online. So if this interests you, Jason has created a series of videos that'll take you through the entire process of building your greenhouse. From layout, irrigation, walkways, and work areas, he'll walk you through the exact process of outfitting your greenhouse in SketchUp. So download the bundle and start building your greenhouse today.